It's September 23rd. I'm Aaron Guy with a look at your news to go. The Palm Beach County School Board voted 5 to 2 in favor of the State Department of Health's updated quarantine policy for asymptomatic students. If a student is exposed, he or she should be allowed to attend class and participate in campus activities so long as the student shows no symptoms. The student can also choose to isolate at home no longer than seven days since he or she was last exposed. Martin and Okeechobee County Schools are also following the state's order. The Palm Beach County School Board also approved expanding COVID-19 testing for students who have been in contact with someone who has been infected. The chief medical officer of the health care district says instead of isolating for five days, students can come back to school if they show no symptoms. They will get tested every day for five days before school, and if the test is negative, they can go to class. The Palm Beach County School District also still looking for more bus drivers. They hold a job fair every Thursday, including today. Officials there say that they're still looking for 166 open positions. They're all available. If you're interested, the job fair is at the Central Transportation Facility in West Palm Beach from 930 until 2. There are some requirements for the job. More information, just head to the district's website right there on your screen. Sandra? All right, thanks, Erin. And we're going to see more of the same as far as the weather pattern we've been entrenched in, but at least a dry start to the morning. Your first warning day planner gives us the widespread storm coverage later on this afternoon with impact weather likely. Heavy rain in a short amount of time, falling on saturated ground. So very swamp-like and very humid again today with highs in the upper 80s. That's your news to go.